What's going on guys? Welcome back to another one of my videos and today we are continuing the Werder Bremen career mode content on FIFA 21. This is episode 5 and we have a home game against Hertha Berlin in this episode. Uh, last time out, if you haven't gone and watched it, uh, please go back and do. We It was a very entertaining six goal thriller as the title of the episode will tell you. Uh, as you can see, there it says Milivojevic on target in draw against Wolfsburg so yes it was a 3-3 draw um, but it was quite good we we were 2-0 down so I'm happy with where it ended up in the end uh, but we did suffer an injury in that game Eggenstein out for four weeks so you'll miss the next two games so what we're going to do we're going to play Mohold uh, there instead of him for the next two games and then Eggenstein will obviously come back Actually, I should take him off the bench as well, shouldn't I? Let's just do that. Einstein. We should put on. And bomb, we'll put and bomb on the bench. Okay, so we're going to get into this game against Hertha Berlin. Hopefully, we can get a win. Obviously, we haven't had a win at home yet. Uh, we've got a draw at home and a loss at home, a win away from home. So, there's the, that's what the table is looking like. We are 11th on four points after three games. Uh, can we be on seven points come the end of the episode? I'll be very happy if we are. That's quite an attacking formation from Hertha Berlin, actually. I've just realised that. They've got very nice players. Luca Bacchio, Gwenduzi, Kuna, uh, Jastain, Kidra, Cordoba, Piatek. There's some very, very nice players. Boyata in that Hertha Berlin side that really could cause us some troubles. Uh, but... Wolfsburg had players like that. Schalke also had players like that. So hopefully we can. What I'm going to do, I'm going to just change something around a little bit. Fulkrug. We're going to put Sargent up front for this match. And Fulkrug will get replaced by Schmidt. J just for this game. Uh, or possibly not if I decide this is the way to go. But uh, from previous episodes, what I've been seeing is that... Fulcrug hasn't got the pace to beat uh, defenders one on one, so unfortunately, he's not looking like the best option. Um, but you know, all right then. Hello, let's get into this game against Hertha Berlin at home. Sergeant then gets things going for the home side. My name is Derek Ray, S and S with me is my Werder commentary Bremen, partner Lee Dixon. And the focus Bremen, is on the Bundesliga. Live action coming up. It's Bremen, Rashid, we did have an offer come in for him Berlin. on transfer yeah, deadline yeah, day. It was an offer for. Obviously, an offer for Rashid. It was £27 million from Manchester United. I did reject it. Um, because he's going to be one of the no really the stars of this career mode, you've got to think. Into the near post, Stark gets it out. Milivojevic, tackle by Kedra and Cordoba, kind of bring the ball forward for her to Berlin and hopefully, well not hopefully, but potentially break away. Getting ball the ball forward. Gwenduzi. Oh, and they do score. Cordoba, near post. There we go, Hertha Berlin have scored, unfortunately. Poor marking. We just couldn't get out. We just couldn't well, get out. Derek Look at the... Why are they all over there? I don't understand why is the left back moved so far into the centre of the pitch. We just let Gwenduzi... He just gave Gwenduzi space on the right. And we can't get back and make up for that mistake. And it's another goal we've conceded this season. We haven't kept a clean sheet in the three games that we've played. Well, four games now, which is unfortunate, but hopefully we can showing a real in the next will couple of episodes. We will have a couple of clean sheets to our name by then. Cunha. Cunha is a very, Cordoba. very good player. I think he's 22 or 23 years old. I'm not really sure. He might even be younger than that, to be fair, but uh, uh, he's very nice. He's, I think, Romano very Schmitt. high 70s, if not 80 rated already. Oh, he's a potentially a great ball Untidy for Sargent. Not quite, though. The referee knew that I don't was know foul where play, that's fouls come from, really. It is. But, oh, well. Some advantage, chaotic. 
Well, that is how to run at defenders. Oh, we just can't get near them. Top rack, get it out. Top rack, it's poor from top rack. You can't even get it out, and they've hit the post. We've got another lifeline in this well, game. We should really be 2 0 down, just like we were in the Wolfsburg game. We never start the game positively, we never get off to a bright start. We always seem to concede first. Except against Schalke, I think we scored really early against Schalke actually. Options in the middle. Mateus Cunha. Cunha, I don't know where he's come from. He was all the way back there for some reason just then. It's a good tackle, Velovic. Rashika. Look at Milivojevic. Milivojevic. There's been a goal in Wolfsburg. Let's hear about it from Adam Trying to switch the play. It was a very nice. Very nice to actually switch the play Harry there. Martinez. Schmitz loses out. It's Harry Martinez has scored for Wolfsburg. He played last time out there, beating Stuttgart 1 0. Many thanks, Alan. Look at that. Cordoba. Well, beaten easily here. Robinson, the left back has done very very well there to get the ball back he's gonna go no he's not he's gonna have to turn back and feel sergeant Josh sergeant it's blocked again oh, the get flag the ball. has gone up here he's offside. offside it is well Bremen certainly enjoying the lion's share of possession way more possession than they have been really disappointing players you know. are looking at each other you got to take control, you've got to take responsibility yourself. Bittencourt swings one in and Jarstam gets it out. Grab hold of it. We briefly win the headers, but then we give it away to them again, and it's disappointing. And news I, coming through, and a goal has been scored the fans in are just cheering again, the details from Alan even though we're losing. I've got to give them credit, they did this a couple of episodes ago. Wolfsburg have a second with Zilli on the update, goal. Alan. They were very happy a couple of episodes ago for some reason when we were losing, but and full credit to them trying to spare us on and help us find the equaliser, but it's just a bit awkward because in the Premier League you don't see that very often because the fans are very unhappy when they're losing. So it's nice to see the German fans that are like this. Sergeant has his shot saved by Jarostan. For a big corner. chance to get level. The crowd are going nuts. Augustinson, Boyata, top rocks are there. I can't really have top rock delivering the ball in. Augustinson, punched out, punched away. and of course it comes to their one man out there. But that's half time. That I mean, it's not been the worst here. performance uh, in this career mode, but certainly I'd You've certainly got to give this man certainly I'd have liked to have better chances really. And I'd hope to have taken a couple of the opportunities that I have had and at least be level. But the tenth minute goal so by Cordoba splits the two sides then. Werder Bremen nil, Hertha Berlin one. As we kick off the second half, well, Her Hertha Kedira. Berlin kick off the second half. Good pass. Wenduzi. A real up near him. Now. Oh, he's just absolutely done me. Oh, a fake shot. I had already slide tackled in and then the fake shot did me then. 50 minutes on the clock. Havlenka's got to get that and he has to got that just about. I've tried to set one of my players. Oh, come on. It's a poor ball. At least Alberto has got Real Madrid, so okay. Well, what does 65 million pounds get you? I'm hearing that's about the I figure they it. paid for him. He's worth a lot more than that, I think. I think he's a real treasure. Let's see how he performs over Bitty the next Cole few games. There. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter attack here. Infield, Schmitz has spotted Rashika's run on the far side. Has he got the pace? It's up in with a chance. He's got the pace and he's got the finish as well. There's 1-1. One, one. Bremen are level. And it's Milo Rashika, that man. Well, here's the, replay. the man of the Super moment, once again in this career mode. Slaps it into the side netting, the past Jarostan. He didn't really have much chance of saving that one-on-one on one like that, but beautiful finish by Rashika. And that is why we've kept him. That is why so I didn't accept 27 contest. million from one Manchester one. United. He's got to be so, so crucial in this career mode. And we find ourselves equal. We equalise, finally. We haven't really done much in this second half to deserve the equaliser, but I'm so glad that it's come because we can now rebuild 
and Gabriel go again, Sanasi. hopefully finding the winner in this one. Rashika out wide, the cross. delivers a ball in, but well, it is blocked by Boyata. Who am I meant to, who am I meant to throw this to then? Okay, that actually worked out. No and a goal has been scored in the Schalke match, out. I'm hearing. Alan McAdami can tell us more. It's a goal for Schalke. 62 minutes, please. Fair enough. Schalke back in the Alan game against Bayern Munich. With his finger on the pulse. Fentelab there. Gets him back into the game. Get for Salise. This is another home game, I've just realised. Uh, I thought another we might be away from home. From I've literally only just realised that we're at home EA in this TV. one. It's Fair enough, Schmidt, Sargent, yeah, oh, he's looking very nice, fast. looking Should promising. So oh, he's shot straight out Jarosan, it might have taken reflection there. from yeah, that slide shot, tackle from the defender him, no there, but the if it didn't then it was not the greatest well, we finish the in truth. They don't lie. They haven't created enough chances today, but the We've had three shots compared to their two, so I feel like 1-1 is probably a fair reflection so far, but... Mateus Cunha. Good oh, Gabriel Salise, what is that pass? It's giving it straight to them, and it's a nice from top rack to intercept that, but they've still got the ball. Askabar. Gwenduzi. Sounds like someone out of Harry Potter, Askabar. And a throw in forthcoming. To be honest, and he probably the substitution is. will occur now. Sh shows my knowledge, but there. Space there we go, Gwenduzi the out wide again. They're not Roman delivering Yarenchuk. it in yet. Yamanchuk. Oh, I don't want top rack to get. Drawn out, top right getting back in the face. area. Uh, this is what Wolfsburg did right in the last few Still minutes against the last game, but luckily they didn't manage to score. But they just kept the ball in the corner and then was going to deliver it into the box. Good that's tackle, Milivojevic. And that's my time of going. Alright, Milivojevic, come on then, son. Well, this is, is a bit and caught. Sort of gets past his man, I guess you could say. Sargent. Moal. Jerry Stan, too close to him, and he easily grabs that. Claims it in his grasp as well. He's just kicked it up the pitch. Oh, as if it's get to, got to the man as well. Should be marking him someone at least. And it's with Roman Yaremchuk. Like when Doozy's playing right mid, really, but it remaining. is what it is. And he's and not done too bad on the right, here. actually, in truth. Lovely work to get past his man. Can't do anything. Mateus I can't Cunha. get near them with a the tackle. Cunha. There and we go. There's the a good ball. tackle. And we've lost it again. It's really, really poor. Just about got it out. Milivojevic. Romano Schmidt. Schmidt. Moald. Goes down that way. Back to Moald. Shot is at Terrace Stan, but he's gone behind for it. Well no, it hasn't gone out. As if he's kept that in. And that's 1 1 final, final whistle. Final whistle I'll take it, seeing as though we were 1 1. It was. We were 1 0 down, but. Oh, I really would have liked to score in added time there. That would have been a very nice end to the episode, but. We have to settle for a draw, and I mean the stats probably, oh no, oh my gosh, I thought the stats would be equal. As you can see, they had one shot on target, compared to our five, so it's disappointing actually, now I've seen the stats. I would have taken it if I didn't know what the stats were, but, because it felt like they actually dominated, because they were in my half for a lot of that game, but clearly we did actually dominate them in terms of stats even though it really you guys probably didn't even think it the stats look like that uh Gabriel Salise sometime in the future probably will look at you actually we'll just do it now because why not squad hub right, let's go and do that now so I don't forget and he gets angry but contract negotiation when I mean, he's 33 years old so he might have a wage reduction I'm not sure I don't particularly want to give him a wage reduction because he's he wants an important squad role so that's fine his current wage is 22 so I could go 20 possibly go just two year extension maybe yeah that's fine I'll take until he's 36 uh, except no release cars we don't want to release cars and his salary should we go 20k with a signing bonus of 100 I don't really know 
Yeah, he's happy with that. So we'll take a wage decrease and a hundred thousand. Just signing on bonus. He's been at the club since 2012, so since he was about 24. So since he was about 23, 24, he's been at the club. So he's a very loyal player. Let's put it that way. Uh, has Top Rack only just come to the club? I didn't realise, but he's only just come to the club anyway. Uh, just interesting looking at some of them things like that, but... I don't know. Let me know down in the comment section below whether you think I should play Fulkrug or whether that... At what, what last game, what I did last game, should be what happens from from now on. Should I play Sergeant where Fulkrug is playing and should I play Schmitz? Where Sergeant is playing. Do I do that or do I stick to what it was before? I'm feeling like I stick to what it was before for a couple of games. But. Anyway. I hope you've enjoyed this episode guys. If you have. Go down below. Smash the like button. Hit that subscribe button as well. If you haven't done already. Really helps the channel out in the future. Um, but I think that's it from me. Next episode we'll see an away trip to Stuttgart. And then after that will be another home game against probably the best team in the league Bayern Munich so that'll be a tough game hopefully we can get the win against Stuttgart though so ease some pressure for the Bayern Munich game um but until next time guys I've been Hazard Junior Cherry thanks for watching and have a great day